guess where we are guys? We are at Dunaluz for our second ultrasound to see if we are having a boy or a girl. And as you can see today I am all alone. Uh, Mitchell, he does have vacation, but somehow he made an appointment to work with his brother. So they are just going to work and we can really use the money. Um, I brought a USB stick with me because um, this time they're going to put all the pictures and maybe even a video of the ultrasound on there and it's kind of sad that he's not here but he's working really hard for me so I really appreciate it and I can do this alone because it's so exciting if it was something not so nice like a dentist or like a really awful doctor's appointment he had to be there with me but for this I think I can do this happy moment. I would like to celebrate it with him knowing if it's a boy or girl. If we find out because this baby can be really stubborn. You guys know that showing his or her butt to us. But let's go inside and bring all my stuff with me. I got all the papers from the first ultrasound um, with a new due date etc etc. So let's get in and make a new video and see if we're having a boy or girl. <laughs> It's so dark already in here, so this is where we're going to do the ultrasound. Exciting! <laughs> and I'm so alone. We were listening to the baby's heartbeat and we could hear that she or he or she has the hiccups. So funny. It's done. Last time we went for the ultrasound, the head was up. <laughs> yeah, now it's done. Oh, I've been waiting for this appointment so long. <laughs> because you were on holiday? Yes, I was on holiday. Oh. Has his um, genitals on placenta? Again. Last time too? Yeah. Let's move it a little bit. See if it decides to move. If I hurt you, let me know. No, it's okay. Come on, baby. Mommy wants to see you. <laughs> the anus and here is where we have to look at Maybe you see the nose? Is yeah. It? Put the hand in front. Mm 
a good position for pictures. <laughs> this is the upper leg and the knee mm -hmm. and the bibs. Oh. Huh? And here underneath is where his genitals are supposed to be. Right on the placenta. <laughs> Mm -hmm. A lot of times when I lie on my side, it starts to move. Move it a lot to see it. Like that. <laughs> the sides to shift where I'm sliding. And this morning I told baby, you're going to show us what you are. <laughs> I want to listen to stubborn just like his or her dad. Normally it doesn't happen to me that I can't see it. You can see the whole leg. <laughs> his feet, leg, knee, upper leg, buttocks. And I see everybody and on this Facebook. This is the placenta, it's like he's oh. riding the placenta. <laughs> <laughs> <You see? laughs> Everybody on Facebook telling me I'm getting a boy, I'm getting a girl, and I'm so I'm almost 25 weeks, and I still don't know. <laughs> a hand, see it? Oh, yeah. Fingers. So flat on its come on, move, move a little. Where's we're supposed to be looking at? And it even has some umbilical cord coming from underneath it. This, this is the second time this baby doesn't show the gender. Come on, it shows us the butt, the butt, second time. And my midwife, she even t uh, told us, I don't know if you guys could hear it, but she even said, it never happens to me that I cannot find out the gender. She even pushed my belly a whole couple of times just to make the baby move, but this baby it's just as stubborn as his dad. So <laughs> um, on Monday I can come back for free and then she will just jump and look at the gender right away and um, maybe we know more on Monday, I hope so. <laughs> this is terrible. <laughs> this baby is so stubborn.